गाइज वट्स अप गुड मॉर्निंग एंड वेलकम टू अ फ्रेश ब्लॉग एंड ऑल्सो अ सनी मॉर्निंग सो गाइज दिस इज द मंथ ऑफ जून एंड इट्स क्वाइट वार्म हेयर सो दैट्स आई एम ऑन इन अ टी शर्ट सो एज प्रोमिस टूडे आई एम हेयर टू टेक अ ऑर्चर्ड ट्रिप एंड फ्यू डेज बैक आई ऑल्सो शॉट अ फील्ड ट्रिप सो दिस टाइम इट्स द ऑर्चर्ड ट्रिप सो राइट नाउ इन माई ऑर्चर्ड्स and guys basically uh, orchards are basically all same and there are no types of orchards so i'll be shooting this video on the basis of the of the fruits like i'll show each uh, fruit tree separately or then i will compile it all so yeah this is how orchard look looks like all around trees trees and trees so let's start So guys first fruit that I'm going to show you is the most important fruit over here and that's apple guys because apple have the most commercial value here and everyone is going for apple uh, these days because it have emerged as the best best source of income so you can see the apple tree and now I'm going to show you the size the current size of apple and that's quite small so I can't taste it right now because I'm sure it will be tasteless because i tried few days back so yeah this is an apple and in this orchard guys guys we have having the most uh, number of varieties of apples so i'll show you one by one so this is the golden variety and there it's the early variety or you can say the american variety and that's the richard and that's the black royal and that's behind is the royal tree so this uh, orchard have the major varieties of apples and this varieties will be everywhere in the village so yeah that's the case of apple and there you can see lots of apples dropped from this tree and this basically is the result of the june drop that occurs in the month of june and this is uh, basically due to the strong uh, winds that blow at at this time Okay guys so now it's time for the next fruit tree and that's pear and that means nashpati in hindi so basically guys uh, the tree of pear grows vertically as you can see and it's not that much spread out so now i'll show you the pear the size of the pear that have grown here so this is uh, the size currently in the month of june and you can see we can't taste it right now because it will be tasteless at this very moment so yeah this was a pear tree so guys the next thing in this orchard is a, a type of vegetable and that's guys coriander you can see the all flowered and they look white at this time due to the flowering over and their tops so yeah th these are all the coriander's going till there so yeah and guys in this orchard we are also having a type of pulse and that's kidney beans uh, in hindi it's known as rajma ki dal so here you can see uh, these are the kidney beans just sown and they are very small in uh, size so so we are also having a pulse here so yeah So guys in our orchard we also get a type of uh, spice and that's cumin seeds uh, in hindi known as zira so this have its own taste and flavor which is quite different from the one one we get in the market so yeah spice also was there in our orchard so guys right now i'm in my another orchard and it's evening because in the morning i shot in one orchard and now i'm in another another orchard so here we are having some other vegetables fruits and cereals so i'm going to show you that here so let's start so guys uh, firstly here we are having a vegetable and that's cabbage you can see all around and in the nearing row there's also a coriander and spinach i think and it's spinach and that this is the cabbage so cabbage is also grown, grown wide um, widely here for our pers personal consumption and not for commercial 
So yeah, these are the cabbages and you can see the size, current size. And till now they are all empty, like only cabbages growing from deep inside. So yeah. Next thing I'm having to show is a type of grain and that's wheat. So these are the wheat saplings and here you can see wheat is just coming out and we have to just dry it later and then thrash it to get the wheat so now uh, i got a fruit to show to you guys and that's the apricot guys see how much have grown on this single stem and here this year we are having good production all trees filled so apricot is you know, locally known as a chuli and this is used for making wine and also for making the apricot oil uh, which have a GI tag now, geographical indication. So this is how it looks and it, this is the general quality of apricot and we have another special quality and that's uh, in Hindi it's known as Kumani. And guys this is how an apricot tree looks like and they are more yellow and of more uh, bigger size than the another apricot and uh, you can see here just with their this is the normal apricot and this is the khurmani so i'm gonna taste one and go for the biggest one so it's quite yellow right now at this moment and it will grow more to this size and later i'll show you the um, final size so yeah it's um, quite sweet right now so outer layer is just to eat so this is what i got inside and now i'm gonna break it and eat something that's inside it so yeah so here we can see the white part and that we have to eat and outer shelling is quite uh, hard so we will throw it and we will eat this so this also tastes good so yeah this was from the apricot So here guys, we, uh, I found a cereal and that's the gram or you can see chicken uh, chicken pea and in Hindi it's known as the kala chana. So this is the plant and you can see how small it is right now. And here I think it's just uh, coming out. Maybe it, it grows inside this. So these are the plants of the gram. In this uh, orchard we are having an, another vegetable and guys that's the most consumed uh, vegetable I think uh, in every place and that's the potato guys so this is how a potato plant look, looks like and as I have shown in, you in earlier videos we usually plant uh, uh, pea or other cash crops in between and then on these partitions the uh, potato are grown so potato grows underground and this is how a plant looks like at this very moment so and here you can see flowering have occurred on potato plant so it looks quite good so guys now i'm going to show you my favorite dry fruit and also the most expensive dry fruit over here and that's walnut and locally known as akrot so here we are having a one of the biggest trees in our village quite large but i'll show you from the another angle and then we'll, you will uh, you will know how large it is so walnut is most expensive here and this is our tree and right now it have a covering also so we need, we have to dry it in our homes and then the cover leaves out and then we will we get the uh, the walnut that we get in the market so yeah that's our walnut tree quite large you can see this goes all the way there and here we are also having a large apricot tree I'm gonna show you so that's there see how large it is so guys uh, now I'm having a dry fruit to show to you guys and that's almonds guys so this is an almond tree quite small and it just uh, goes vertically and you can see that and the almonds all over here and 
this have a uh, covering like the walnuts and this need to be dried to get the apricot that we get in the market so apricot tree guys guys right now we got a grape uh, tree here and this is a grapes uh, creeper and no, it's not a sorry it's not a tree and uh, basically it's a uh, apricot tree and on that uh, we have planted the grapes so they are very small right now you can see it's not even uh, properly visible so later i'll show you the when it grows large and grapes is basically uh, used for making wine here and also for uh, personal consumption so yeah grapes all around and the apricot and the walnut trees so guys uh, one thing i have to add here is this apricot and this uh, walnut are nearly a uh, Hundred years old, and these are since the times of my grandfather's grandfather. So, quite old they are. Another vegetable, guys, we are having in this orchard is of pumpkin. So these are all pumpkin uh, plants, or you can say creepers. But uh, no pumpkin is visible right now, so I can't show you. It's just the leaves, and I think here pumpkin may grow. So. We are also having pumpkin, guys. And you guys, now here we, I got a strawberry tree, but no strawberry is visible right now. And these are the tomatoes again. And here is the garlic. So, guys, the last thing uh, I'm having to show from this orchard is this tank. And guys. Uh, this basically is a compost tank and this have earthworms and here we usually put our cow dung and animal waste and also some uh, plant waste and then it just get decomposed by the earthen worms these are the earthen worms here they are moving right now so we are having lots of them in this pit we water them regularly and they eat all the dungs and the waste all right so guys this was all about our orchards uh, like from the orchards so in this video i got to show you about the fruits that we grow here and also the vegetables and cereals and also some sort of spices so this was all about our orchard trip so i hope you enjoyed it and uh, i tried to uh, show you the all the fruits and vegetables that we are growing right now and also uh, after some time i'll shoot another video to show the next stage development and in this video i just show you the current developments here so yeah this was all and thank you very much for watching do like this video and also share this video because if you share only then more people will enjoy the himalayan vibes and also guys subscribe to this channel if you haven't subscribed yet and do press the bell button also so that's all and my comment sections are always up open for suggestions and i'm happy that i received some suggestions in my previous videos and i'll try to work on it so that's all goodbye take care stay safe peace